the moment. <gasps> Fine. Come in then. You might as well meet the family. Oh, Mallard's Mark, here we go. Are we quite sure she hasn't actually died this time, brother? She looks dead. Smells it too. Ooh. It has been a hard road. But I can clip you both around the ear to prove I am no ghost. If it would help. Forgive us, mother. We're just surprised you still know how to find your way home. She always brings the smartest people home, too. Enough, Ryan. I taught you better manners than that. No, you didn't. A sending spell can carry 25 words. Do you know how many Jahira's only message contained in all this time she's been away? Seven. <laughs> now there is a phrase Jahira has never uttered, but no. The message went, I'm sorry, you know what to do. So why haven't you done it? You were supposed to get the young ones out of the city. And you were supposed to be dead. That's what your oh-so-stoic message meant, yes? Yet here you are. So, what happened out there? I got my skin saved by this one. We've come to take the fight to the cult. Which is exactly why you all cannot be here. Why? You plan on winning, don't you? You're the one who saved her, so tell me. Are we all doomed? See, Mother? A little positivity. You are a very irritating girl. Uh-uh. This isn't your house, remember? You'll keep a civil tongue under our roof if we let you stay at all. Have mercy, sister. She's old, after all. So old! Seems I'm outvoted. See, mother? That is how you go about talking things through with your family. Now, if there's more to discuss, then bloody well come in and wipe your boots. A fine day to you, sir. Are you known to this court? Ugh! A ruffian has breached the manor. I shall have the girl at the door beaten, her hair pulled. Jessam discovered an old family tree in my study. We haven't had a moment's peace since. Tetherian nobility. You might be royalty, Jahira. You don't want to be queen, of course, and Ryan curses too much, so it would have to be me. <laughs> Careful, girl. They have a habit of taking against tyrants there. Huh. I'm not a tyrant. If anyone calls me one, I'll have Fig chop their head off. I take no responsibility for your plants. You know I'm more of a mushroom man. You've let my study turn into a thicket. Is this what I am hearing? I tended to it. I just let it thrive in its own independence. You know, same way you raised us. I raised you to be a sweet and kind boy. What happened? I watched what you did instead of listening to what you said. This house has taken in a lot of children over the years. Mother dear was sometimes more commander than, well, mother dear. I believe the phrase she preferred was, the fouler the fertilizer, the fairer the flower. Oh, so you do listen. I've only ever seen her truly angry once. We were down the market when I was about nine years old. Some merchant started in with the usual. Yes, but where's your family? Whose son are you, really? When mother was done with him, well, Let's say he won't have any sons of his own to worry about. Hmm. Nature's law in action. I hope you were hibernating, little cub. I can't think of another reason you wouldn't come down to say hello. J Jahira! I... D 
d d didn't w want to see if you were, were really dead. They said... Who said? Jord and Ryan. They didn't think I c c could hear. You little sneak thief. Well, they were wrong. Look! Not dead. I just... had a few adventures. Like, uh... Um... No, Cub. He does not mean me. Now, Cub. Solitude is a wonderful thing, but not too much. Come downstairs and fight with your sisters. Wait... here. I was... K keeping this safe. My Harper pin. Oh, was a certain little sneak thief playing down in my sanctuary? N no, no. Commander! Spare me your salutes, little traitor. You walked me right into that ambush. Sorry, Commander. You are my commander, but George promised me pies. Huh. I can't fault your priorities. You look after them for me? Can I have a real sword? No. Hmm. Fine. No arguing. Just tell me you're well. I... I'm well. And Minsk? We're working on it. You'll get him back. I owe him a kicking for showing Fig how to throw hatchets. So, this cult. What's our plan? I'm not fool enough to think I can change your mind. But if you're staying, I don't want you taking up arms. There are other ways to fight. Really? Like what? You shame me. In all our hunting, I had put them from my mind. Right. Leave them to us, then. If we can't get them past the checkpoints, we'll at least make sure they're watched over if it comes to fighting in the streets. If I have to stay home and babysit, then it's your job to make sure there's still a home to look after. Take what you need, and we'll do the grand reunion when you come back for good. So, lovely as it is to have you back, Mother. Go away. You have work to do. Aye, aye, Commander. Wait, one more thing. There are doppelgangers among the cult. Be on your guard. Huh. All right, then. If you turn up looking for hugs and kisses, I'll be sure to shoot first. That's my girl. <laughs>